my buddy Chris. Just came out of the woods. <laughs> Tell by the beer. We're in Stratford. We're heading north uh, to Wasaga Beach. That's where we're going. Oh, we've got a couple hours to drive. It'll be fun. There's the new car. Needs a boost. I'll do that. Kind of a blue. Driving the new car. Don't know where to put the camera yet, so the mirror is in the way. But uh, the heat works. That's for sure. Ooh. It's warm. So it's got a little muffler leak, which uh, I think a new muffler will repair. Needs to do a few things. It looks like it needs brakes all around, and uh, simple. That's simple stuff. It's got a ABS light on, which uh, I'll have to diagnose. Figure out what that's, uh, what's causing that. What else has it got? wrong with it. The uh, bodywork, it needs a front bumper skin. It also needs uh, a piece of trim on the wheel arch in the back. The passenger door in the back is uh, pushed in a bit. The guy told me his daughters were using it and they took corners too tight. And that's what the, what the marks are from. So we've got, what time is it? It's got to be about 10 o'clock, so it'll be another uh, three hours to get home. So far I'm pretty happy with this little car. Driven it for uh, about half an hour now from uh, Wasaga Beach is where we came from. It's running fine, not making any crazy noises. Not right now, anyways. <clears throat> Got the cruise control on, going along. Almost 90 kilometers an hour. Working good. Radio works. Where we are, though, that <laughs> is, uh, we're up in the hills, and it's a really bad uh, spot for radio reception. So channels come in and they go out. They come in and they go out. Well, I look forward to uh, really looking into this car a little later today. Maybe get clean in it. Uh, it needs a good cleaning. And, uh, yeah, making my list of stuff it needs. Typical <clears throat> Canadian winter. so thick you can cut it out of the air. For an hour and a half now, things are still pretty good. Had to stop for coffee, uh, tea break, normal stuff. Chris is behind me. You can't see him because he's stuck in that big cloud of cotton candy. Just cut this out and package it up. There goes some of the cotton candy cutters now. They're just off to go cut the cotton candy and package it. Oh, there's some more over here. On the Continue side. on County Road 121 for 19 kilometers. That's where we are, is County Road 121. Part of Cotton Candy Land. Big Rock Candy Mountain doesn't have anything on this area. Here comes some more cotton candy cutters. They do it by hand. So they all use their old horses and buggies to get there. Cut all the cotton candy by hand. Well, oh, here's one on a bicycle. That's fancy. You know, those ones are diehards. The ones without the, the roof on their little cart. Pile. 
just getting out of church. Now they're off to cut the cotton candy. You can tell by the way it looks outside is we're in the heart of the cotton candy cutters area. They grow it, they cut it, package it, sell it all over the world, this stuff. It's kind of a white. If you want, you can get different colors. They add the color later. I guess it's too hard to grow the fancy color stuff. I don't, I don't pick it. I don't even need it. Here the uh, cotton candy's been harvested. They, uh, they always leave a bit in the fields for seed. Still on the way? <laughs> it's a long drive. It's three hours. And we've got about 45 minutes left. Ah, uh, things have been going well. A lot of police though, wow. They're everywhere. But, it's to be expected, the cotton candy was really thick earlier. Ashtray cam. I'm taking Chris home, thank you. That was a good day. Yeah, that was a bad good job. Took longer than I thought. It's uh, two o'clock. I thought we'd be back by one, but. Could have had to, something to do with the top speed of the smart car. Maybe. If it didn't wind it up enough. <laughs> if you wind it up and it clicks twice, that's how you get the top speed. Whee! So, what are you gonna do for the rest of the day? You're gonna play oh. with your new toy or? Yeah, I can get clean it. So, here it is. It's home. It's got a trunk or the stuff in it. The seats fold down like that and like that. I think they flip up too. I'm not sure how though. So this? Oh, this is a CD holder. Great. We don't have CDs. It's nice to know though. Anyways, it has this has its own little problems. It's missing some trim here. Dent the door. And that piece of trim. Missing this piece of trim. You'll notice some tape. <laughs> tape there. I have to get a new bumper skin for it. That's the engine. The battery charged on the way home, so hopefully it'll uh, keep its charge up. We'll see. Don't know. Find out as we go. I'm gonna walk on Daddy's back. Okay, I'm ready. Oh. Careful, I'm heavy. Yep. Right here? Yeah, don't jump. Oh. Down a little. Oh, yeah. It's hard to balance on your back. Yeah, hang on to the wall. Down a little more. Right there? Uh, yeah, over this way a little bit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Down a little. Oh, yeah, right in there. Oh. <laughs> mm. Okay. Ah, uh, I think that's it. Thank you. Ah, uh. <laughs> you're a pretty funny little girl. You're a lot of fun. Okay. <sighs> now what can we do? I'm, um, uh, I'm gonna roll over and do some. Uh, um, how about now? Stretches. Matt? After you do stretches, um, yeah. What call it? What call it? I'll put pillows behind your back and we can play euchre. <laughs> Maybe. I'm gonna stretch first. Okay. Euchre with the little girl. We're tied. No, we're not. Oh, but I've got three. She's got two. The cat's sleeping under the blankets. A beautiful wife's doing work. And I'm saying good night. No! You have to video us doing this game. Okay. This is my hand. <laughs> oh, it's hard to show Jasmine looking. What? Turn one over, Jazzy. <laughs> Okay, you get to pick first. 
Clubs are up. Clubs are down. Clubs are really down. Go, 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 go. Hmm. I'm making it. Spades. And. Thanks for watching. Remember to click subscribe, the bell, and something else. You'll know what to do. Tell your mom to. Thanks.